Now, we're at this point nine games into the season. I know the first two or three games you go, okay, Cleveland, young team. Or Sam, it, it looks like the pieces fit together as far as their bigs are concerned, their backcourt is concerned, that they could be a team that plays well all season. What I like about what JB and the staff is doing, they're trying some new stuff. If you look at that front line, that starting lineup, they are huge. They start on basically three seven-footers, mm -hmm. and then they got those two guys that can handle the ball and shoot in the backcourt. So when you watch them play, people are saying, well, they got to be slow defensively. But when you're playing against with all that length, it doesn't matter because if you get by marketing, you got two other seven-footers coming and Jared Allen coming at everything. So if those three guys learn to work together in tandem mm -hmm. and cover up for each other, and when you get beat, just keep coming, stay in the play, and get the, guard, the ball out to those guards. The biggest thing for them offensively, Smitty, they got to create spacing mm -hmm. so they can keep the lanes open. So it's important that they don't those three guys, big guys, don't just start getting yes. to the basket, yes. hanging around the basket. But if they can keep the floor spread defensively, man, they can be scary because they're just so long. For Portland, at what point do you start – to look at it like this isn't working out this season, you got to make a move. Well, I say, what's the definition? I mean, I, I mean, there's not a high expectation for me for looking at the Portland Trailblazers. The reason why is I'm looking at the talent they had last year, and they lost some. They haven't added much, Sam. So, I, I, my my expectation is is not high with the Portland Trailblazers. I look to them as being somewhere around a seventh, eighth seed. Hopefully for them, everybody else has gotten better, but. I think for them is we all watching it. They rely on those two guys, just jump shot after jump shot. And then also, if you're going to rely on those two guys, you, to be able to be a playoff team, they have to get stops. They can't get stops either. So defensively, they're not there. Offensively, not there. I don't have that high. Talent-wise, they're just not good enough, yeah. Sam.